I don't know what this is. Where's the other leg? Check that out. That's crazy. This here is Ruby's mom, Emma. She's acting laborish. What's going on? There's Ruby. She's come to observe. Let's say hi to mom. She's been pushing for a while with no progress, so we're gonna see if we can help her out a little bit. Where's the other leg? Okay, now I... We're in business. What's the back leg? Where's the other back leg? This was what was presenting. So I could feel the hip, but both of the legs were in, and there's no way that she can birth it out that way. There's another one. <laughs> that second one's bigger than the first one was. <laughs> Foot, what's Buck's kid? baby in a bag. That's a big baby too. Check that out. That's crazy. There's the mouth. There's the your eyes. bag. The mouth here. Ready? Yeah. So that was our most complicated birth that I've had to help with. They have to present with a leg or a head, typically a leg and a head or both back legs. That one was just coming out tail first. It wasn't gonna come through. So I reached in and hooked a leg and then reached in and hooked the other leg and pulled them legs first. Typically when I have to help, the baby will come out head first with no legs and they get stuck on the shoulders. And then I have to reach in and hook a leg and try not to pinch the neck while I'm reaching in there. Or it'll be head back and you'll have to reach in and turn the head and bring the head out. That was crazy. Probably saved all three babies and mom by helping. Okay, you're done with that one. This is the one we're working on right here. Right here. Not me. There you go.